ABT is more than just a phrase, it's a way of life. Stick around. What is going on everybody? I am literally sitting in the dealership in my brand new Dodge Viper and by the time this video comes out you will have already seen the video of all the details and stuff so this video was probably shot a couple weeks ago but before i go another inch i've not even driven this thing yet we've got to do a tune on it and specifically i'm not about to drive this thing all the way home with cag still enabled cags skip shift whatever you want to call it why it's even on here is mind-blowing it's a performance car. You pay a gas guzzler price, like, get over it. So, without further ado, let's jump over to the tune. I'll show you how to shut it off, and we'll get rolling. Okay, so I've already downloaded the tune, and in fact, on this last generation Viper, the fifth gens, it's one of those things where it connects to it, and then it just loads one, uh, you know, can't save, blah, 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 loads it off the web or some crap like that. Uh, the only downside to these things is... It costs 20 credits to license this thing. 20! <sighs> HP tuners, you're killing me. But this goes on almost any vehicle with CAGs. You can shut it off through a tune super easy. You just go underneath trans and you're going to look for either CAG, skip, shift, whatever it's called. In some cases, it'll be a toggle, a drop down toggle. In this one, it is literally just enable and disable so we're going to take this up to 300 no didn't like that so we'll have to go to 299 299 to enable and we'll go to 98 to disable so anything under 298 degrees is going to shut off cags simple we'll go ahead and save it save it as cags disable and let's flash this thing in. Ugh. Ugh. Take my 20 credits. Ugh, I'm crying. <laughs> What's happening here? Oh, there we go. You got to hit the right button. Yes, I know it can't be undone. So, no right config on this. Have to write the entire... And fingers crossed everything goes all right, because if not, <laughs> I'm, I may have bricked my brand new car. It's going to take about three minutes. Listen, this is what I'm talking about. This is what's nice about uh, platforms like HP Tuners out there. These small, simple things, even if you're not really wanting to get far into tuning, you can do things like this, like disabling, skip, shift. Instead of buying, I'm not going to buy a harness, tear the dash apart and try and figure out how to plug it in, break tabs on the plastic, end up hating my life because I went through all that just to get rid of skip shift. So as you can see, this is the easy way of doing things. And, you know, granted, it's super expensive on Dodge Viper, but on your, you know, Corvette or your whatever it is, your GTO, you know, it's going to cost you 50, 100 bucks on top of your, your uh, interface. So I'm going to let this thing finish and then I'm going to get on the road. I've got a long drive back. You guys know the drill. Thanks for stopping by the garage. Remember, ABT, always be tuning. <laughs> 